So you've got the sentiment gap there on the euro dollar then from uh, what, what your previous slide then? Yeah, um, exactly. That's making the point that you can see that uh, the euro dollars follow the differential between the US 10 year and the German Bund, the German 10 year, very, very closely until the last week, until this last rally through 114.90, 114. And it, it's overdone and it's hit. Uh, big resistance and created the gap. Now, one of two things has got to happen, basically. You know, the market may be overly long in the short term, the short term punters. But what it's actually saying is, is and we will come back down. But unless that interest rate differential, that interest rate differential could turn up and they can meet in between. So you've got to watch the differential that's turning back down because it probably will come back up a bit. And so it is creating instability. And with instability comes volatility. So until those two come back, until they say the German boom's going to trash even more or US rates are going to come off, then the market's likely to go sideways as, as it works itself out of its overdone, over, overly exuberant short-term position and the interest rate differential adjusts.